All right, hello everybody. Hopefully everything is working. Okay, it's it is your boy Warlord Two Nine Seven here. I hope you guys are having a beautiful day. Uh, we are here playing Hogwarts Legacy. If you don't know who I am, my name is Warlord Two Nine Seven here, or Rick, and I play a myriad of different games. Um, many of which usually just come out or. If I ever have the time to play older ones, I try them too. I love retro. I love retro games. Big collector of all of them. Um, but today we are playing Hogwarts Legacy. And we are playing as Anakin Skywalker. Tried to make him as close as I could. We just need leather. Black leather. Um, but yeah, we're here streaming on Twitch. Uh, and we will be uploading this later to YouTube. So if you prefer YouTube or you prefer Twitch, you know where to find me. I stream not often, but I will try to stream a lot more. Well, let's continue our journey. We are in the Forbidden Forest. I wonder if any of my spells will help me through this. And uh, we are finding the missing pages for Jackdaw's Rest. We're almost done the quest here. Accio! Incendio! pretty good pretty good uh if you guys are new to hogwarts and you are like actively playing you should change the settings and um because in the settings you can actually find that <clears throat> oh, what? that platform ought to be able to float straight to me pretty dope um but you're able to see be able to change the settings and also be able to instead of having to look where you shoot now you can just move your character in the direction of an uh, approaching attacker and then be able to like attack and shoot and all that instead of having to look all over the place Accio. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. <laughs> yeah, man. Find all the riches. Got the Emmy Pie in the chat with murder. All the murder. What's up, babe? <laughs> I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? So we do got a bunch of chests here. We found a bunch of little trinkets. Go this way. Did you see the two videos? No, I didn't get to see any videos today at work. It was really, really busy. Dead. Cursed fiends. It's crazy. It was behind me. Another puzzle. But if Jackdaw could solve this, so can I. What was the video? Could you like tell me what the video was about? Oh. Is it for this section of the game? Remarkable. Looks like the bridge is slowly opening. Nothing here. 
Oh, that's creepy. I think those spiders actually come out and... They can actually come out and bite you. Using the forbidden curse spell, then being hunted down in the school for using it. Really? That's crazy. Is that a part of the story, or is that just that's something separate and extra? An untouched chest. Tartal wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Akium. That moonstone. It's a good thing Jackdaw didn't fall down there. Separate. Someone went around killing teachers. You can do that? I didn't know you can actually kill the NPCs, like good NPCs. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. It's probably a that's probably only on PC. And it made a mod where you can kill the NPCs. That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loop, but there's no sign of him. I'm telling you that's a little something behind for me. Changing the but settings is pretty good. Be? Makes it a lot easier to fight. Incendio. So how am I gonna go through that? Let me ocean. That's weird. How would I go through that? I don't think I, don't think I can. Oh, uh, there we go over here. This is where we're supposed to be. Uh, that makes sense. Discord sent out the notification. Um, yeah, I think because Reach is connected to Restream, the alerts. Restream is the one that sends out the alerts to the Discord. Skeleton in sight. If you could at everyone on Discord, that would be I helpful. I may as well help myself to this. That's odd. 
I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sense. Treasure. Treasure. All the treasure. Give me the treasure. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Akio. An untouched chest. Jackdaw wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Finding a lot of loot here. Tons of loot. There it is. The bridge, it's almost complete. More spiders. He's gone. You're so foul. Oh wow, what a, a, the big one. Guys, I destroyed them like as if they were nothing, bro. <laughs> that was crazy. Oh, Warlord, you're so awesome! Thank you, thank you, people. Thank you. Mallow's sweet leaf. Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. I'll need to look around for the symbol. <laughs> Just jump down! There we go. All the tea. It's a good tea. Vic, can you actually check to see if the, uh, if the, not that you go and start, see if the stickers, if it allows you to do the stickers, like, remember you was telling me that it wasn't before? I must be getting closer to Jackdaw's remains and those pages. Huh. Uh, speak of stickers and it pops up. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. Oh. Those splinters must be what's left of Ollivander's wand. At least I can take the pages. Wow, that's crazy. This is Jackdaw, man. Here it is. The map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm. Is there something beyond this room? Oh, robots. I mean... Accio! Incendio! Let's go. 
good at this. <laughs> Too good. That's how you get things done. And get Skywalker for the win. Overpowered. I've seen this before. In Gringotts and the restricted section. <laughs> hey, you got the bay in the chat with the sticker bay. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> that was legit. Nice. Thank you, thank you for the biddies. Yeah, guys, if you like to, uh, if you like, if you like to do biddies, there are unique ways of doing it. Uh, you can use the stickers on your, so you can click on, if you're using mobile, there, there should be something that at, on the right side of where it says, give the sub now to be number one. There's like a little square on the right. If you click on it, it allows you to do uh, stickers. Uh, and then you can do like uh, biddies here. You can put, slap a sticker on the screen. Where am I? Whatever you want to do. Oh no, the room's starting to flood. How am I being protected? What sort of magic is this? I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. <laughs> what is this place? Looks like a battle arena. Paintings moving. It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention. And might I presume you share our ability to see traces of ancient magic yes sir i do as you have likely realized by now our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic we can access expressions of magic that few others can opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent do not squander them i won't professor thank you we have much to discuss but first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. 
I'm a bit confused, sir. Why is this room called the map chamber? I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. The statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside, those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that I would be here? I cannot say more at present, except to say that your presence here does not entirely surprise me. It's cool that the painting can have, like, the consciousness of a past wizard. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We shall speak again once the book is in place. Talents plus one. You received one talent point each time you increase your wizarding level. You have new talent points to spend in talent menu. Oh, that's cool. You've earned talent points starting at level five. You may spend these talent points as you wish to enhance your spells to increase your combat powers, stealth, and more. Choose wisely. Talent points may only be spent once, so the number of talents you acquire will, will be limited. Return here often to see what new and powerful talents await you. Oh, that's cool. Enemy struck with a transformation spell. Transform into explosive objects. Oh, that's cool. It really does come down to what you want to learn. Oh, wow. Defeating a cursed enemy restores some of your health. Or, per perfect protego releases a damaging blast that breaks enemy shields. Stupefy deals direct damage on impact. And stealth. Petrificus totalis immanentis emanates an area of effect that can impact nearby enemy. Room of requirement. The duration of the focus potion effect will be extended when any spell from spell set is cast. Okay, that's pretty cool. Well, I'll just hold on to I'll just hold on to the points before I use them all. That's cool that they added that into it as well. So not only do you get abilities, but you can... I found the pages and the map chamber. Why would I need the book? How nice to see you, my young friend. So this is an... They added a foo, foo flame, so I should be able to come back here another time. But it's cool that they added, an, like, a skill tree, pretty much. because it looks like we're killing it. I'm back at Hogwarts. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't neglect my studies while he was away. Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Let's complete Jackdaw's rest. Rebellion. I saw a meme, or uh, not a meme, or a TikTok that says, uh, Revelio, Revelio, Revelio. Yeah, I was like, you need to learn to pulso, the banishing charm, useful for pushing objects or adversaries away. Complete the required tasks and meet me in my classroom. Okay. Got a page. There should be a flying key somewhere. 
Rebellion. Somewhere. Somewhere is a flying key. I'll find that flying key or somewhere. There it is. So it was literally in my way. <laughs> Got him. Smack the key. Another key. Revelio. Sleeping dragon. Biggest dormiest nuqua to tell in this means never tickle a sleeping dragon. Made of stone it will never awaken. It may be tickled to absolutely no effect. Where is it going? Where is it going? There we go. There we go. Another house token. We're right through that guy. Rebellion. I'm not missing anything else down here, right? Doesn't look like it. I am missing something right here, literally right here. There we go. Urn of Ashes. Five, three more pages and I'll be done. The chest on the opposite side. It's really dope that the paintings move. Rebellion. Over here. Another key? Where where are you going? You're going all the way up. <laughs> it's it's literally saying no one can stop me, I'm all the way up. There we go. I'll smack that freaking <laughs> smack that kid. Alright. Rebellion. Toads are singing. Rebellion. Frog Choir. Here perched the slimy yet symphonic frogs that comprise the Hogwarts Frog Choir. These magical amphibians can sing in six part harmony and hold a pitch better than most humans.
Rebellion. And the Goblin Artifacts. One away and I'm done. Ah, so I never went on this side. Keep going then. I did find a whole bunch of other things. Oh, where's the strike on? Magical piano that just plays on its own. Revelio. Knocked over the I knocked over the books. I need that. Well, the magical piano. Piano that plays on its own. Okay. He said yes. Lumos. So somewhere where there's a sphinx. There's a sphinx under. Under steps somewhere. And that's a dragon. There's not anything down here. Rebellion. Reveal. Reveal. Nah, I don't think it would be outside of here. Yeah, I don't think that butterfly would be outside of the steps. But not even outside the steps, not like out not outside of this area. Rebellion. Where was it? It was down there. That's locked. The door over here. That's the piano room. that look like Lumos I am definitely not positive on where that could be maybe over here is it still technically a part of the building Rebellion. church but for wizards is that Merlin yeah pretty cool let's see it's behind nothing can't open that door can't open that door yet nope not for me so the only thing I can think of nope can't go there either so over here. Lumos. Lumos. Yeah, nothing. Uh, 
Oh, time to select the new the next quest. Do I, a, do I have any side quests? Professor Sharp's ex assignment. Ooh, flying class. We learned to pulso first. Acquire and use a focus potion. Acquire and use Duro's potions and use them simultaneously. Descending for sweets. Talk to Gareth Weasley. Looks like everyone's asleep. All the students are in bed. I think it's funny that they don't ask for curfew. And they're like, student, go to bed. Why are you awake? Incendio. This, what are the what are they supposed to do? Hmm, so the bridge we need to find out what's up with the bridge puzzle people. Revelio. Reveal something. Reveal to me. Reveal it all. Go oh, this way. Nothing that way. Ah, there we go. Leviosa. And I completed it. 50 out of 50. Rebellion. Where's the key? Oh, the key's up there. Oh. Accio. Oh, wait, wait, there it is. Should be, a, I sh literally should be at level 19 by now. I missed. I'm sorry. <laughs> I was about to say, if I miss again, that poor key. That poor, poor key. I gotta wait there. All right. That was an interesting class. Thanks to you. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. I appreciate your help. I hope Sharp wasn't too disagreeable when you handed in your potion. I heard him talking about taking responsibility. <laughs> Professor Sharp was annoyed, but we sorted it out. No harm. Cheers to that. He probably had a good chuckle after we left. Sharp may seem gruff, but I'd bet a few galleons he blew up a potion or two in his day. Best be off. Next time we talk, I promise, fewer explosions. Is that literally it? 
So what are we gonna do? Were you calling me, Gareth? I was. After you helped me with that fupa feather and potions, I reckoned you might be just the person I need. You see, I have an idea for a fizzing Wisby inspired beverage, but I'm missing a key ingredient. You and your concoctions. I don't know how you come up with these things. It's a gift, truly. So, I suspect the key ingredient in fizzing Wisbies is dried billywig stings. I heard there's a store of them in Honeyduke's cellar. I'd get them myself, but my Aunt Matilda has her eye on me. Thinks I need to focus on potions class for a while, not for my own bruise. I was hoping you could follow a secret passage to Honeyduke's cellar and grab a few dried billywig stings for me. Sounds simple enough. And who wouldn't want to go to Honey Dukes? Ah, brilliant. Thank you. The passage is hidden behind the statue of a one-eyed witch in the third floor corridor. Just tap it with your wand and say, Descendium. I'll see what I can do, Gareth. Fair enough. You shall be the first one to taste my newest brew if you can be of help. Perhaps I can convince a meat to help me with my potions homework. Get my aunt to loosen her reins a bit. <laughs> Descending for sweets. I need to get those dried billywigs things for Gareth if he's to finish his latest concoction. Oh, this is nice. Look at this. A one-eyed witch statue shouldn't be too hard to find. Doesn't that look nice, guys? Revelio. Ah. House point hourglass. These large ornate hourglasses contain rubies, diamonds, sapphires, emeralds, are enchanted to keep count of house points for Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, and Slytherin, respectively. Ah, these are the points? That's amazing. Yo, Hogwarts is rich. Rebellion. <laughs> I mean, says steal it. Like, let me see if I can break it out of there. Oh. Doesn't work. It's too messy, Professor. I'm gonna try to find that spot. Oh wow. How did I not get here before? Wait, E2? Oh, but here's the butterfly. That's so cool. Look at the floating candles. Yeah, that's, that's awesome. Revelio. Oh. There's a food flame. And now I see the key. Oh, there it is. Okay. Rebellio, Rebellio, Rebellio. Who has that annoyed him so far? Lumos. It's like every single streamer that you go and watch, that's all you see is Rebellio, Rebellio. That's all they do. <laughs> Myself included. Go. Got another page. Then we have a key. Wait. Rebellion. There it goes, right here. The Great Hall ceiling. The ceiling of the Great Hall has been bewitched to mimic the sky above the castle. Oh, that's cool. The when you look up it looks like smoke and all that. Like clouds. Where did it go? 
Oh god, here. There we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Right there, got him. We got him. Yeah, baby. All the house tokens. Revelio. Can't unlock that yet. Light like this on fire. Incendium. Grab your page. On to level 19. That's right. Keep it going. My people in chat, if you uh, if you play Hogwarts, what house did you pick? Any new people in the chat room? Ooh. We got a puzzle over here. The first one, right? So we see here. It's zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine plus seven. Oops, sorry, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 28, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. 20, 20, 20, 20. But we need a spider. Cool. So the bottom one. Eleven and zero. So we need twelve, thirteen, fourteen, so zero, one, two, three. We need a hydro. And then let me save. I remember remember the bay talking about this I save before I open it if I don't like what's in it I can pick something else it'll change house wall banner and a scarf now let's see if they patch that let's load back Let's see. Let's see if I if it if I can change what pops up. Thank you, babe. All right. Ah, oh, frame portrait. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> Let's load again. <laughs> when do you get the broom? That's actually the next, um... That's, that's one of the main missions. Is the broom. It's, I think after I finish this side quest, then, it's, then I can get the broom. statue spring ivy scar that sucks the uh the first time was the best one let me try again one last time i promise one last time <laughs> Yeah, it's funny, the first time was the best time. I didn't, I didn't touch you from here. Please. Okay, cool. Whatever. It's green. And it raised my stats. So, whatever helps. Take it. 
Um, and then there should be. Rebellion. I guess avenging you. Over here. Find the statue, the one eyed witch. Where the Where did the key go? We got them flying. Ah, oh, here it is. Token. Can I reach that? Incendio. Nice. I thought I would have to fly up there. It's cool. I indeed, do not have to fly up there. Incendio. I don't remember this being here, but take it. I will gladly take it. Rebellion. Did I burn it? Incendio. Guess not. Don't burn. Don't burn the <laughs> the map. No, I don't need to go inside the frog's mouth. Not yet. Smuggling spiders into school? I jolly well was worth a month of detention to us. Do you know what made her get a real pet, a cat or a dog? Is that a howler? Just something normal for Merlin's sake. <laughs> It's cool that they have howlers. And I started watching the actual, started watching the actual movies. Now they they, they make more sense. <laughs> this looks like the right statue. Um, what was the password? Come back, page. Come back, page. Come back, page. Ah. Uh, Descendium. Descendium. Goodness. Who knew this was all down here? The flames turn. The lift must be how I get down. Looks broken though. Luckily, there's a whole spell for that. Here you go. 
go. That seems to have done the trick. Up a chest. Let me uh, let me upgrade my gear real quick. Look at all my money, seven thousand. So much money. Put on my shades, but then I take them off because I don't like having shades on my face. Then I got gloves. Put them on. Then I change the color because I don't like green. Put them back to black. Yeah. Then I then I go and look at my hat. I put on a hat. Then I take off the hat because I don't like wearing hats. Then I got a scar. Put on the scarf and then I take it off because I don't like scarves. I got a legendary robe. Take this to the room of requirement to reveal its quality. It's cool. Mystery robe. Got this. So powerful. Look at that. 815, 132, 134. The stats are so gorgeous. Wonderful. This castle will never cease to surprise me. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like this this castle is ginormous. Your gear slots are full. Hmm. The map is not available. No. It means I can't sell stuff. Let me go and see. I don't want to leave any treasure behind. Look at that. Gold dragon eye spectacles. Spectacles. Little by little, two. I'm uh, just. Ooh, amazing. Look at those glasses. <laughs> hork lunches, hork lunches. Give me all the hork lunches. Spiders. Incendio. Rebellion. Oh, there's a chest over here. Here's a complete Merlin trials. Oh, but I did. Scared the heck out of me, man. <laughs> oh, man, it's so loud. <laughs> Legit. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Woo! Making it rain up in here. <laughs> you got me good. <laughs> Jeez. 
<laughs> like, I do. That's this one. Hold on. But I, I get what you mean, though, like a jump scare. Ah, like a FNAF. Oh, so he's back. Yeah, I added them. I I added good ones. This is what they all. This is what they all look like. I'm trapped. Yeah. You know? Then there's this one. You are my friend! Yeah. See? Hey, Trap! What's good, my man? If How I you doing? This platform, I think I could get it to work. What's up, Trap? You got Trap in the house. What am I supposed to do with this? Incendio! Let me know, Ah! Hello, Scar. Welcome. I'm going to have to get past this. Hey, this is a side quest. This ain't even a main quest. Kind of madness. I'm alright. Got the next part for my PC today. I'm three parts away. I'm having it complete now. That's awesome. I died. Oh. Oh, okay, I'm not dead. I thought I died. I was like, no! The frog? To increase your gear slot capacity to sell excess gear at vendors. I need to get out of here. I need to like go to, I need to leave. There's so much gear here. So yeah, today I got a got an i9. Oh, holy cow. What? Really? Yeah. Legit, your thing is OP now. You gotta oh I have unlimited unlimited power! You do. That's, that's a really powerful computer. Incendio. Now I don't want to hear any excuses of your limitations of your power. I'm doing good. Just had a night out with this stream to today. Go. Make it across. That's awesome. And then in like two years, tell us about your time with your stream team. And then two years until we'll release this new CPU and my current one will be obsolete. Something is getting in the way of that platform. Not even. My, um... The... That did the trick. Not even, Trap. I'm playing with a computer from 2017. It does everything I needed to. Right. This must be the way out. I need to find a way to open that gate. No, not the chest. Oh, so many chests. So many chests.
Yo, my stats, bro. Stats. Too powerful, my stats. Look at it, look at this. <laughs> Classical school, bro. No more treasure, just, just let me level up. Incendio. Something smells sweet. And again, have to be close to honey dukes. And again, have to show up all the Jedi's now. He has to show up all the wizards. Legit, I wish you were here earlier, Trap. I was literally fighting, like, um, I was literally fighting these um, these giant spiders, and I killed all of them within 30 sec, like at least a minute, 30, 30 seconds or a minute. I was like, unlimited power. Felt so OP. I think a cat outside is getting murdered. Flamboyant cloak. Exit the Honey Dukes. <laughs> nice. Yeah, no, it was really cool. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? <laughs> Wait a second, I'm in Hogsmeade now? Honey Dukes. I can smell the chocolate. Now, where would I find the dried billywig stings for Gareth? Uh, I really need more gear slots. Mad that I had to destroy. So, so Wicked danced all night, and the rest of us watched her dance all night. Some dance a little bit, but we are a group of majority of introverts, so we were all just chilling and talking most of the time. But that's good. That's good that you guys at least got to connect and that's funny. <laughs> Wicked just watched. Oh no, I have a bunch of unidentified outfits. Yeah, no, that's really cool. What how was the music? What was it like? I have the dried billywix things. Now back to Gareth. I can only imagine how his new recipe is going to turn out. Oh, so that's how you get down to that part. So you're telling me that Hogwarts is linked to Hogsmeade through that cellar? Guys, yes, that's insane. Honey Duke's basement or cellar is linked to Hogwarts. Is sell my stuff. I don't go to her. It sounds like what happens when a bunch of nerds get together in real life. Dang. <laughs> it was most likely it was mostly like Nobody's country pop type songs. It was Why a line did you buy me a second pair? I hate oh. these socks. socks. So so if you're it smelly, you'll have them worked out for yourself. I'd rather have no socks than be dancing like this. You're not dancing. Plenty for your perusal today. Father. Take your time. Yeah. See? And you said the charms come out in the water. Sell it all. If I haven't said it before, it's a pleasure doing business with you. Anyone think you had an affliction? Has he been hurt? Oh, please, can't we take these socks back to Mr. Hill and get me some when normal ones? When you pay ones? for your own socks, then you can choose. Until then, you'll learn to be thrifty and behave. You'll learn to be thrifty? Papa, can we really wash charms out of you? Don't be absurd. That woman will say anything to avoid spending a canal. You really don't have to spend money. It's game. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Get myself more tea. Rebellion. Ah, look at that. Hello, hidden chest. Chest with the eyeball. How you eluded me. I stalk you. 
you sense my presence. I just want to touch you. <laughs> I, just, I just stole his, just stole his essence. <laughs> well, hello there. Come in, look around, and if you've been eating chocolate frogs, please refrain. All right. So, I guess I'll teleport back. It was love one person was like who thought it was a good idea to bring a bunch of introverts to the most extroverted place we decided next time we all go out we are wearing pokemon onesies that's funny oh man i gotta be at level 20 for this okay take this to the room of requirement to reveal its qualities where's the room of requirement Have I found this room of requirement? Just travel there. What are you going to dress as? Said that travel broadens the mind. Playing this on PS5 is fantastic. It's always frown. The loading Take time makes it great. Hello, Gareth. I have those dried billywigs things. You got them. Incredible. I charge him. Happy to help. Here you go. This is brilliant. Can't wait to get started. Thank you again. I'll let you know when I brewed my first batch of fizzing whiz beer. Descending for Chris. And then what else is left? Man, this guy is going to get everyone drunk in Hogwarts. I hope so. <laughs> Ghost of our love. Use the map with the floating candles to find the treasure. Forest bridge and candles. Oh, that's outside. You're a level 19? <laughs> yeah, man. Fire and use a focus potion. Let me go, let me go back to here. Yeah, man, it's called side questing. And I still haven't gotten my broom. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Where's the potions? I'm looking this way, it's on my left. Oh, this is the potions? Okay. <laughs> Welcome. Do you let me know if I can be any yeah. assistance at all? Something here. Solid. Give it to me. <laughs> I thought I did that page already, but I guess I did not. What can I do for you today? Says I need a focus potion. Five hundred. This would be for a potion that reduces the drinker spell cooldown. Five hundred. What's my mission? I need to I buy this. See you again. Farewell for now. Acquire Maxima and Endurance Potion and use them simultaneously. Endurance Potion. Purchase the recipe for Focus Potion from J. Jip. 
Wow, bro. Okay. What can I do for you today? All right, so I guess I do need to start buying these recipes. A wise decision. Thank you. I'm so poor. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Should I use them? I use the focus potion. That's dope. What can I do for you today? Adaros Maxima. A wise decision. Thank you. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Maxima and Adaris. So Now I need to use what can I do for you focus. Today? A wise decision. Thank you. Excellent. Attend potion class during the day. Now I teleport back to Hogwarts. And complete that side quest for to get that ability. Cool. The power of having money. is so intimidating. I guess I learned. Return. To How are your assignments coming along? Good. I guess. I completed your assignments, Professor. Good. You should be ready to learn to pulso. Let's see what you can do. Concentrate. Do not let your mind wander. There we go. That was quick. You've got it now. Ah, yeah. If you'd like to practice, and I think you should, perhaps best not to go flinging your classmates about the halls. I suggest having a go at the enchanted books here. Oh, okay. Oh, another spell down, legit. Also. Seem staunchly determined to master your spell casting. I'm almost at level 20. <laughs> it's a or a spell that pushes enemies and obvious away from the caster. Yeah, oh bruh, I'm about to be level 20. I think I finished all my side quests. Now it's for flying class. Finally gonna get my broom. And that's only because I couldn't figure out where where that thing originally was. The um, I'm talking about where the candle, the bridge, and all that stuff was. Unless it magically just pops up in front of me. Who do you think will fall from their broom first? Everybody grab a broom and we shall get started. Awesome. Mr. Clothen, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. 
everyone. Tower. Please welcome a new student to our flying class. Hello. The goal of today is point, to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely. As broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Not a fan, I take it? <laughs> now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. For those who need a refresher, step up to your broom, say up, firmly and clearly, then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Thank you. Now, your turn. Up, 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 you stupid ratty school broom. Up. My dad was like, now. One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. If you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. Up in the name of the dark side. <laughs> Good. Now, for your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Do take care. The brooms are school property. I want them returned in one piece. Wish I had my own broom. <laughs> this is brilliant. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? Sure. Her eyes got cross eyes here, shall we? This next set of rings will take you around the grounds for more of a challenge. What a view! <laughs> Hello! Nice day for a fly! That wasn't too bad. That's cool. Ah, oh, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as a first year. Yes. Nice. Our aquatic resident likes to make an appearance once in a while. Huh. Ah. You saw that freaking crack it. <laughs> this is rather fun. I say, I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We met in the common room. I'm Everett Clockton. So, care to join me for a bit of high-flying fun? I can't say no to that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. See where he's going to take us. The tour is about to begin. Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. <laughs> Lovely as ever. Let's hope the Headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? Ahead of the gardens, the Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. Bit claustrophobic for my taste. How has Everett flying so quickly? Here's something handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. 
helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. <laughs> now that's more like it. You sure you're not part hippogriff? So what hippogriff allows them? Hippogriffs have an ability to There's fly faster. Bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. And the Almery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Flying tips and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tour, Everett. That's Kagawa's whistle. This concludes our tour. Best hurry back. Yeah, this is nice. Looks like he's already dismissed class. Better hurry and hand in our brooms. Dismount here. And where have you two been? Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. Mr. Clopton, I am disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor, enough. Class is finished for the day. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. Chin up. That was some rather good flying. Oh, I care. That's right. Always doing a great job. Fantastic. Let's Sorry about that business with Kagawa. But you have to admit, those views were worth it. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. I could show her a thing or two if it's I true. had my own broom. Hate having to return true, to true. school broom after class. Perhaps I have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spintwich is in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. Complete main quest six. But I haven't gotten my broom yet. I just know how to fly. Well, no quests are popping up. If I could afford the new Bright Spark broom at Spintwitches, I'd be on it now. Library venture. How did you fare? If you're keen for some illicit spell practice, meet me outside the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. I know a discreet place near there. Good day to you. I require assistance with a delivery. I thought you might be interested. Please visit me at J. Pippin's Potions if you'd like to earn a few coins. Please meet me in the seventh floor corridor as soon as you can. I have an idea for somewhere you can focus on your studies, away from prying eyes and distractions. Yes, I got a bunch of messages. I'm so loved. Demanding delivery. So we gotta go to. I go to Hogsmeade map and spawn there. Make a delivery for potion. Hogsmeade, here I come. We have everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look around. Hello, Mr. Pippin. You need help with the delivery? Yes, I do. A capable student such as yourself should have no trouble making the trip to Cambridge. It's just south of Hogwarts. What do you need delivered? Fatima Lawang ordered a few invisibility potions. 
I used to go myself, but lady. lately Fatima has taken to turning every visit into an argument. Constantly complaining about the quality of my stock. But how can I maintain excellence when she orders so often, giving me no time to brew? If you take this rather irritating task off my hands, I'd happily allow you to claim the delivery fee from Fatima. I'd be happy to help with the delivery. Sounds good You've to no me. Idea Give me that how money. Grateful I am. Truly. Here are the invisibility potions she requested. Hopefully she won't give you too much trouble. She's a talented potioner in her own right. I dare say I wouldn't mind having a look at her potion recipes one day. Mr. Pimpin is trying to pimp some uh... this ah new face wonderful hello mr weeks is it albie weeks at your service welcome to spin witches apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted had to travel as far as london to meet with my supplier and i've only just returned thankfully with inventory i presume you're in the market for a new broom Got a few rare yew weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows, wind wisps too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. You said disrupted trade routes caused you to close spin witches. Terrible it's been. Trade routes reported as unusable. Evidently criminals are overtaking roads, threatening hamlets. I can fly safely almost anywhere. But you try flying with an inventory of brooms on your back. No easy feat. <laughs> right then, back to work. If a particular broom takes your fancy, just let me know. Sounds quite the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. What are we looking for today? Oh, pretty cheap. Fiery temperate. Celebrate your project at Hogwarts House Pride. Finally crafted from ashes, broom is broke, built for stability. Quite a stylish broom with a light touch, quite literally. Um, you weaver, comfortable and speedy broom with a unique woven design. That item is of the highest quality. That item is of the highest quality. I really do like fiery temperate. That item is of the highest quality. Yeah, I'm gonna do the Ember Dash broom. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Thanks for stopping by. Whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancement? Go on. Ha! Knew I was right about you! I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct the broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. As it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Reyes, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved. I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? That sounds intriguing. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your while. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Reyes will sort you out. 
Once you've beaten Imelda's time, be sure to let me know. <sighs> I can't help but admire Mr. Weeks's enthusiasm. Oh, that's cool, you can ride certain animals. Okay. There's a lot of quests to do just from getting just from completing that room thing. Manage the three. Feeling hog speed. Let's see, can I fly now? I know what that means. Merlin trial. What do I have here? Okay. Oh, okay, so I gotta bring these things to it. Lumos. Complete the tasks I've given you and then meet me in my classroom to learn Defindo, the severing charm. It's typically used to cut an object, but can be a powerful weapon when needed. Hey, I got a bunch of questions popping out of nowhere. They're like, oh, you learned how to fly? All right, here's like a million quests. Okay, and then this one should be the last one. Definitely makes this a lot easier. Rebellion. I know I'm not a trial when I see one. What to do with these? Easy peasy. It's funny, I just I just climbed them. I didn't really think anything of it. Rebellion. Oh, that's it. Hot balloons. That's it. That's awesome. Get 50 XP Rebellion. just for that. Heck yeah, man. Any day.
I don't got enough. Let me also. Oh, that's not a. Oh. Pop. This is amazing. This game has just reached a whole nother level of awesomeness. It's, it's, it's never boring. There's always something new. Revelio. And there's two more side quests all the way down there. Jeez. Side quests everywhere. Okay, let me see if I can spawn it and just spawn closer to the delivery. Um Yeah, it looks like it's pretty close in distance. To even all the other foo foo. Oh, where is it? Not there? Hold on. Keep on popping. Another fifty. The undead are down there. Could it be a Merlin trial? How nice to see you, my young friend. Hello. Rebellion. Another field page. Just drinking <laughs> random beer. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, be careful. Just end up murdering myself by accident. Yeah, so the wizarding world needs honey for their tea as much as the muggles world does. Rebellion. The chest here. Bottom botanical leaf. It's like a place right out of a storybook. Like Pippin should have been here by now. Mm -hmm. Stuck. Oh, that's cute. Look at this. Revelio. Yo, that's too loud. <laughs> Scared the hell out of me. Thank you for the biddies. <laughs> Thank you. But damn. Scared the heck. Just, just. Emmy with all the biddies today. Sheesh. I'm here like kind of falling asleep and then I don't know where it is. Yeah. Thank you for the biddies and yes, I was that the reaction you wanted? Yes. Rebellion. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> yes, that's what I wanted. Oh, I can't get in there yet. Okay. That Pippin should have been here by now. <laughs> Madam Luang, 
I have a delivery from J. Pippin's potions. <laughs> Sent a child to do his work for him, did he? Always cutting corners and taking the easy way out. Did he have your bro them for him as well? Doesn't matter. You could probably do it better than he can anyway. Why do you keep ordering from him if you think the quality to be inferior? It would seem I have more and more customers who are trying to stay out of sight. I'm not one to judge. <laughs> you can simply imagine the stress I'm under to deliver quality products. Unlike some vendors, I strive to keep my customers satisfied. Satisfaction. Here are the potions you requested. You think it's so simple? I know Pippin is always trying to cheat his customers. Cutting corners to save some galleons for himself at the expense of quality. You'll not be getting a canut out of me until you prove the potion works. Drink it. You want me to drink the potion you just bought? Sure. Seems simple enough. I'll do it. I should think so. Drink an invisibility potion. It seems to have worked. Hmm. Well, I suppose that will do. If the demand for potions is as high as you say, have you considered being easier to work with? Perhaps combining your recipes and skills? Ha! Not a chance. That ne'er do well had his shop handed to him. The rest of us have to make our own way. I'll not give him the benefit of my hard work and gumption. If he fails on his own, so be it. Thank you, sir. Okay, so I guess so. I guess so. Very well. I shall let Mr. Pippin know I delivered the potions as requested. You do that. What do you have for sale? What are we looking for today? So she sells leech juice. I should have a bunch of this stuff. This will do just fine. Thank you. Thank Gotta you get my money here. back. I had ten thousand. Appreciate it. Okay, return to Perry Pippin. Is it okay? That was quick. that was easy enough. Fast travel, cause sheesh, that can be wild. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. I mean, now I actually get it. Like even caves Come lead on, to Hogsmeade. Man. Healing potions of a speciality here. Should you need any? I delivered the potions to Fatima Lawang. Very good. And uh, did she cause you any trouble? I can see why you didn't want to go. She was quite cantankerous. I do truly appreciate quite your help. Quite cantankerous. And cantankerous. Uh, Someone with... write that down. <laughs> what a name. What a word. Delivering those potions was a bit more work than I'd expected. I'd like an additional fee. I suppose that's business for you. Very well. I shall increase your pay. But I'm not at all pleased about it. Best of luck with your potions, Mr. Pippin. Do take care. Give me my money. Pushing here's cap. His side quest. 500 gold. Yeah, man. I, I just had to deal with the, that excruciating woman. Follow the butterfly. So now, talk to Clementine Willard. See, a whole nother quest. I haven't been in here in a while. I'll say it again. Revelio. Pardon me, but were you saying something? Oh, hello. 
talking to myself. I'm Clementine, Willetsy, charmed. I was musing on the precious butterflies I see near the edge of the forest. Whenever I come near, they fly off into it. When I was at Hogwarts, we truly were forbidden from entering the forest. Told horrible stories about it, and I've had an irrationally intense fear of it ever since. It's silly, but I'm insatiably curious as to where the butterflies go in the forest. You couldn't possibly find out, could you? You want me to follow the butterflies? I do, yes. Really? If you wouldn't This is what I'm doing now. What were the horrible stories you were told about the Forbidden Forest? Oh, goodness, everything from students being mysteriously beheaded to terrifying spider dens. Oh, trust me, you hear that at 11 years old, it sticks with you. Very well. If I have time, I shall see where they lead. Oh, how kind. Students these days have so much more courage than I ever did. So she sends another right student to go die. Hope to see you soon. Where she didn't want to go. That's crazy. And like the brave idiot that I am, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to the forbidden forest. I'm gonna go look at that place. <laughs> Off on another adventure, are we? Forbidden forest to go look for butterflies. Caution centaurs. Frogs sold here. Yeah. <laughs> there they are. She wasn't making it up. Well, we've come this far. Miss Willardsey might get an answer about these butterflies. Hmm. Might as well just fly. to this chest that's cool that's it oh. that was an easy quest oh, I got a trophy yay applause <laughs> yeah, man. that's cool it gives you a trophy Oh, please tell me you have an answer for me about the butterflies. Yeah. Gives you a trophy. Hello, Miss Willardsey. Well, what happened? Did you find them? I did. They led me into the forest and revealed a treasure. Oh, how lovely. I'm glad you were rewarded for your efforts. <sighs> Perhaps one day I'll be able to bring myself to go into the forest. For now, I'm happy simply knowing there's something so lovely to see. Should I dare? But I took it so you couldn't see it. Welcome. Follow the butterflies. They already about to be level 21. Halfway through. What? There is something lovely and its name is John Cena! <laughs> I mean, I like this guy more, okay? <laughs> Can actually find this place. Ghost of our love. It doesn't show the quest there, so no. Oh, 
No, I'm cool with it. The ghost of our love. Um, treasure. Fast travel to the Forbidden Forest. Get in on the oh. <laughs> Forbidden Forest. What are you up to now? Okay, so it says or it's just north of Hobbit. Fast travel to Forbidden for a food plant and cross the bridge into the forest. Then follow the path to a set of garden chairs and table on a bank on the left of the main path. Lumos. This has to be it. Turn a table on a bank on the left of the main path. The chest is supposed to pop up like right here. Lumos. Yeah, the chest is supposed to be right here. But the candles aren't floating. I'm supposed to find the candles. They should be at the entrance. It's been ages since I've found anything worth poking this crack from. Like it's supposed to be at the like there's a lamppost. Halfway between Harvard, if you uh, walk on the bridge, the one on the map next to the food plant, and cast Lumos to reveal a set of floating candles. Ah. Lumos. <laughs> Wait, so if you uh, okay. Walk to the bridge, the one on the map. Walk to the bridge, the one on
There they are. Enchanted candles. Wonder where they're heading. It's okay. All right. <laughs> we found them, guys. They gotta get close to that stone arch or that stone. The candles seem to be leading into the forbidden forest. Grab the letter. Damn it. What letter? Ah. Oh. The letter. What letter? Where? Oh. My dear is Apollonia. Ap Apollonia. Apollonia. Would you care to join me for a picnic? I know you enjoy a good Cornish pastry almost as much as you enjoy a good mystery. See you soon, I hope. Yours, Richard. I'm so romantic. <laughs> oh, wow. I saw something you could grab. I did. Yeah, you, know, you got good eyes. And the fact that this, like, the stream is that sharp that you can see that, that's crazy. I'm gonna squirrel. The treasure must be nearby. I suppose a picnic in the Forbidden Forest could seem romantic to some. That is cute. Treasure hunting suits me. Nice. Almost done, baby. That's cool. <laughs> I'm happy. <laughs> I'm big on these side quests. And then the next one is flight test. Thank you, Scar. I gotta go to here. Then we'll just fly that direction. Rebellion. Don't, you can't enter while mounted. Ravenclaw. That's right. There's Skywalker. Ooh. Amelda Rays? Albie Week sent me. <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The nerve. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Caught wind of you showing off in flying class with Clopton. Seems someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Me? Slytherin Quidditch captain. Jealous of you. Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers, I, and bumbling. I hate the her. <laughs> but for some reason, now people think you're competition. Oh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. You're not even Slytherin. Could be a useless squib for all I know. Enough of this. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin versus Ravenclaw. Would you suck? Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. I liked how he like he looked down a little bit, and the hair was like around his face. And he just he <laughs> kill her. Oh crap. For a second I forgot how to fly. 
find it. Crap. Ho, ho! Oh my god! <sighs> Man. I missed all of that. Skywalker, your pod race is just a pod racing. <laughs> now that's more like it. Yes, yes. Yes. Yeah, it's very good. Good Skywalker. Let's see. This is rather fun. Woo! Maybe. Oh, did anyone else see that? Just destroyed her. Just, just completely decimated that woman. Good. <laughs> this is what I think about you, fool. Oh. Uh, that's not. You, you must have cheated. You. Oh. Fine. You won. Yeah. Don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Surely my win means something. Eh, you're not terrible, but you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. I don't want respect from the likes of you. All you do is insult people. You and everyone else need to get a thicker skin. Anyway, I'm moving on to the next course. It's near Irondale and offers a much tougher challenge. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Albie Weeks. Incendio. Oh, Cadabra! One day. I suspect Mr. Weeks will be glad to hear how I fared. Return to Albert Weeks. I gotta love their accents, man. Solid accents. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Oh, you're back! With something to report, I hope. Oh yes, Mr. Weeks. I was able to set a record on my broom. Incredible! Miss Ray's must have been shocked. Tell me, how was the broom? A little turbulent, and it's wanting for a bit of speed, but it fared well enough. I will say that it tended to drift a bit to the left on certain turns. Heard a slight swoosh when I dipped. Oh, thank you. Hmm, that's precisely what I needed to know. Drifted, eh? I shall get to work immediately. Even the naysayers will be forced to admit that my work's had potential all along. Why would anyone doubt your ability to upgrade brooms? No, oh, you'd be surprised. People get set in their ways, worry that fiddling with what's working fine will somehow ruin it. <sighs> Those people don't appreciate the sense of freedom that comes with quality broom flight. Nor do they appreciate all that's involved in the creative process. I have a friend in Rome runs a shop like mine. Says it's worse there. <laughs> of course, they do nap in the afternoons from what I hear. And where would we be without enhancements? I mean, if Elliot Smevic had let the no-sayers get to him, we would never have had the cushioning charm. I don't listen to him. I'm excited to hear more. 
I have a very good feeling about this upgrade. I guarantee you'll be pleased. Expect to hear from me soon. Hmm. How to address the issue of altitude as it relates to speed? All right, cool. So thank you. Uh, so if you have watched this video all the way up to the end, well, thank you so much for being here. Make sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Um, and yes, follow me on Twitch so you can watch this live. And thank you to all my Twitchers. This was a fun experience. And I hope to catch you on the next one. See you soon.